This is the worst thing. And I can't even park my own car. They're taking a beat. They literally take my car up the elevator and take it all the way upstairs. I can't even park it myself. So I'm like, I'm about to leave my car and I'm like super nervous. I gotta carry all my bags down the street. I don't have a cart to take them or anything. This man right here is doing nice hat. I love it. I dig it. Yo, we are here. Oh my God. Yo, you guys, we're back. We're here, we're here, man. We haven't slept in over 24 hours now. <laughs> We've been on the road. I'm like super drained, I know he is too. Dude, we messed up, man. I had him driving through traffic. Um, basically, we are looking at a mansion right now. I'll reveal it to you here in a second. We don't know a whole bunch of information about this exactly. Um, we do know an owner of Abercrombie and Fitch actually owned this mansion. Um, it was actually built for his wife. This was her fantasy um, type of house. It's basically resembles a castle and it's huge. And it's like I'm looking at it right now. You, you you're gonna see it. It's like on 40 acres, and it's huge. Um, it's pretty beat up. People have been back here tearing things up. Um, other than that, I don't know a whole bunch of information on this. I will follow up on that towards the end of the video, and I'll put it down in the bottom too. Too deep. Here we are. When I tell you this thing is huge, it's huge. I don't even know where to go in at. And it resembles a castle, like I said. All the windows are broken out. I keep hearing things back here. We are in here. It is wrecked. It is wrecked. Super wrecked. I can't even tell you where everything was. <laughs> Honestly, I mean, it's just like being so big, you can kind of tell it's like kind of old style, you know, as opposed to modern. Right. It seems like the room is still small. Well, until we come to this one. Oh my god. Like dining, bro. This is amazing. Look at these windows. Like I said, each thing was specifically made for his wife, exactly how she wanted it. Now, he actually was a founder of Abercrombie & Fitch. He basically started the Abercrombie & Fitch because it was going to be something small. It turned out to be something that somebody like, what was his name, David Rockefeller? Yeah. yeah, yeah. He was even purchasing things from him um, exclusively before he even released any of his clothing. It started as like hiking gear, exploring gear. Um, things to keep you warm while you're out just living. Obviously. And it, it transformed into something much bigger than that. It definitely turned into something way bigger. Look at these. The chandeliers are still hanging here. I wonder if I took these yet. Because they're really in good condition. But like I was saying, the, the company became something that he didn't really approve on anymore and it was kind of growing too fast and got out of his hands and he literally sold it and that's about all the information i know about this place other than we found this place randomly and i'm just like super excited about it see the vines just growing through the window man dude he had a fireplace on here his middle patio. we gotta go out there Hold on, look. Bro. The lights oh. had crosses on them. Oh. I thought that was spray painted on there too. Yeah, it looks spray painted, but it's not. I'm not sure if that's, that's not like anything satanic, I don't think, but it looks a lot different than a regular cross. Do you think, <laughs> you think that was supposed to be a cross? Yeah, because it's on there, on this yeah, other one too. Yeah, it is, it is. That's crazy. On there too. Yeah, that's crazy. Wow. You got the sunroof, 
Dude, it's so bad here. Literally every one of those lights have crosses built into it. Look at the spiral steps. I know for sure from some of the reading that I found, he actually had this here. See how tall it is? He actually was allowed to shoot guns here. And it, like I said, he's on like 40 acres of land. So he had his own gu gun range here. Oh my God. And he also joined the military after he sold what was left of uh, the company that he owned. Wow. Look at the roof just caving in. More spiral steps. This place is beautiful. And just to let you guys know, this place is on the market actually. Selling for $3 million still. Look at the condition it's in. Do you think it'll sell? There's a basketball hoop here. Another house. Looks like a side guest house down there. And there's a lot of freshly chopped wood. Like somebody comes here and uh, chops a lot of things up. Probably for one of the houses nearby. Look at this. This boat. Some more boats. Here's another one of those. I can't believe I missed this when I walked in the door. Like I said, it has crosses all over it. Every lighting fixture in this house has crosses on it. There's, yeah, I have to look into this a lot more. You can see everything is like, the roof and everything's falling down. The stone that was once built. I'm really trying to find out how this place is still worth $3 million. We got some old couches in here. Another one. And a chair. Oh my god. And this house is actually well built. Wow. It's like metal sheeting on it. What? Look at this little tub. This most baby tub I've ever seen in my life. Bro, you washing one foot in there. You cannot wash anything in there. <laughs> one toe at a time. We gotta go. The floor is super weak. Oh my god. See this big hole? <laughs> now, we got some spiral steps to go up. I'm nervous. Look at the vines. The vines are literally taking over. Taking over the whole thing. All right. This is high, bro. <laughs> oh my God, my, whole, like, my heart dropped down to my Bro, this is super high. Oh man, I'm scared. Bro, get in here. <laughs> get oh in God, here. Bro. Literally, the thing we just walked on is coming out of the wall. It's not even connected anymore. Oh, that's not right. Oh, man. We can't go back down there. How are we going to get back down? Oh, my God, dude. It goes up again. We are literally, like, in the attic right now. And the ceilings are, like, 30 feet tall. This honestly might be the biggest room in the house. I don't know how much higher I can go in this place. There's, there's roof access though, and you guys know how we go. There's the oldest bed with like the librarian ladder that goes up. <laughs> and another room over here. Watch out for the cords. These are the librarian. <laughs> Take you to the uh, autobiographies. <laughs> okay, what is this? There's like a, a cellar door, but like that's not even connected, so I can't even trust that. Attic, I'm definitely not going down that. We oh, are oh, we're in the attic right now. We're gonna go one at a time, man. That's probably the best. You hear that? Oh, oh my god. Another level. 
Bro, bro this know. is gonna be scary. I don't know. We can trust this, bro. <laughs> we got to. Look at the videos coming out the wall, bro. Oh, man. Should we trust it, you guys? <sighs> yeah. We, we, okay. we, we wouldn't be too deep. One at a time. One at a time. Oh my god, dude. Eddie, bro. <laughs> Oh my. Eddie, bro. <laughs> bro, why is it so high? Bro, my knees is knocking. <laughs> you look like a reindeer. <laughs> reindeer. Bro, it looks like you're going up to heaven. Oh my god. Bro, you should see this camera shot. Oh my god. Is it just that? Bro. I'm on my way. I'm on my way. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. Yo, there's nothing to hold on to. Bro, it's bad. What? <laughs> what? It's so cold up here, bro. Oh my god, look at this. Look at it shaking. Oh shit. Oh fuck. Oh my god. Oh my god. I am nervous as fuck, and I do not mean to cuss. <laughs> oh, I'm scared. <laughs> Yo, we are on the top of this old ass building, and look at it. You can literally see for miles. Oh, man. <clears throat> My hair got super long. We probably look different. We probably look different to them. Those who have been following us <laughs> since the very beginning, I used to have, I had short hair at the beginning of everything. And um, well, we've been doing this for a year now. Man, just over a year, dude. Over a year, we're a year in. Y'all remember uh, Rolling Acres, man? The first one, man. Rolling Acres Mall, the first one. If not, scroll to the bottom and check it out and give it a like for us. That's our first video. And we done came a long way. Now we're on rooftops right now in man. the middle of nowhere. Man, they know how we feel about rooftop views, man. We gotta get the rooftop view. The rooftop view is the best view. It's the scariest view, but it's the best view. It is, especially on this roof right here. <laughs> We're walking on like <laughs> nothing. We're walking on blankets. The whole bottom <laughs> of this house is like gone. And we're on the roof. I don't know how it's holding us, but we better get down. <laughs> we better get down from here. That's a chicken Is it? <laughs> the view one more time. The sun's not really out like I would like it to be, but you can literally see for miles and miles and miles up here. Really. Let's get down from here, man, before we <laughs> don't make it to the rest of our explorations. Let's check the rest of this place out, man. I don't know how I'm about to get down from here. <laughs> we got this, this little tight angle. How tall was he? Three foot? That's not fair. All right, all right. They Whoa. say they say don't look down, and I'm looking down. We are approaching what seems to be full house, guest house, extra house. I see a bed like on the rooftop. <laughs> oh my god! A lot of personal stuff in here, man and another spiral staircase that goes downstairs. We are in here. Yo, I found the Matrix. The movie? Yes, on like, cassette. Like VCR? Yes, the VCR, <laughs> Warner Brothers edition. <laughs> New release. It's still in there? No. We found a picture of the owner. I'm not sure exactly which one's him, but I would want to say this one with a daughter. And this is all the kids' toys here. And it says, Holiday Inn. We found it in a, as a bookmark in one of these books. What is this? 
I'm gonna actually put that back in there. Yeah, dude. What book was this? He got pretty far. What's the name of the book? What happened when? Is it another picture? It's him and his wife, dude. Definitely. Another picture. What's the back say? Nothing. Nothing. That's him and his wife, though, dude. That's definitely. Definitely. I'm gonna wipe it off. Wow. This says 1975, dude. That has to be his wife, that dude. has to be his wife. Oh my God, dude. Wow. These photos are from 32 years ago, dude. And they're still in good condition. This is sad. We have like little kid art. It's like somebody drew these. Dude, what the hell? That bucket right there is literally full of photos too. They're soaking wet. This little girl. Wow. Let's look, there's more. And they're like, somebody set them up. So we can see them. Look at this. A picture of the little girl in the bath. Well, she's in the sink washing. And there's like a bunch of dead spiders like all over it. It's so creepy.